Hi Sagittarius, it's Elle here to do a random reading. This will be from October 9th, uh, 2019. Just a general energy around you. It might resonate with you, it might not. It's okay if it doesn't. Just keep on going, keep on pushing. Uh, so thank you to those who like, share, comment, subscribe, who actually support the channel. It is much appreciated. So let's get into this. We have three cards pulled here. We also have some shells. And then we have the cards at the bottom of the deck. Okay, so we have the Queen of Air. Someone's being very objective, very logical, very clear with you. This could be a Virgo woman uh, or a Gemini Libra Aquarius who you are dealing with. I'm hearing Taurus too. Um, they may be wanting some truth from you. They're giving their truth. They're expecting the truth from you. They're open to hear to listen to what it is you have to say this is also a person who gives really good advice because once again they are objective um this is a person who's at a place a space in their life where they want to, they want to clear away all that doesn't serve them everything that doesn't ring true or resonate with them uh, so maybe that's why a conversation is needed. Communication needs to be had. So let's see. We have the Ace of Air. We have the Five of Air. The Ten of Air. My gosh. <laughs> so Sagittarius. Either you are coming up as an air sign or there's an air sign you're dealing with. Or somebody's coming up as an air sign. Um, Taurus, also Virgo. Um... Gemini we have someone who is cutting through the BS they want clear and concise uh, communication they're also cutting away and starting anew this is someone who's going to have a challenging new start because the challenge is to cut away the old what doesn't or what did not serve them um, the challenge is maybe there might be opposition here. There's interference. There's other opinion. There's gossip. There's slander. There's rumor. There's heavy arguing. There's someone needing to feel as if they, they've they won the argument by any means necessary. There is someone who's going to friends, family, um, and speaking negatively about a particular person this could be you doing this sag or this could be the other person or someone around you um, this once again you need to review everyone's motives here there are other people involved interference there's some reversal there was a time where you thought things were moving forward but it looks like something crops up from the past something that you thought you dealt with it is back uh, could be dealing with a Taurus. This is someone interfering in your affairs, in your life. Ten of air. This is, wow. You go from the ace to the ten. It's like, from the ace to the five to the ten. It's, this is lightning fast. It's over. It's done. This difficult time is over. And at the bottom of this deck, we have end of an era. I think you're putting something or someone in their place in regards to situations. Maybe this could be, this is some masculine energy. This could be one of my masculine Sagittarius or a masculine energy that you're dealing with Sagittarius. Um, you may be putting an end to something difficult, something you've dealt with for five or more years, maybe even ten years, something that there's always someone interfering and causing reversal just when you think it's going good this is a person place or thing that just rears this ugly head and it looks like either the sag or the other person is going to really put an end to this and embrace a, a significant change in their life um and and now with doing that and standing up to someone she's also standing up to someone um Things can get better. Let's see what this is about. Well, we got join in. I don't know if you need to join a group of people to help you to recover from 
an addiction. Some of you are recovering from an, an addiction. You've cut something out of your life. And it's hard. There may be someone else who may pose a threat to your sobriety, but it looks like you put it into all of that. You kind of um, get very clear um, and realistic on the fact that you probably can't hang around the same set of people. You need to join a group of a new group of people. For some of you, that is the issue. The end of an era, maybe the era of being stoned out of your mind, high, um, addicted to. Let's see. Well, yeah, closed. We have closed. So some of you are closed to. Um, a particular person, place, or thing. Okay? You've closed it off with the Ten of Air. Um, hard. You have hard. Yeah, it was hard. Addictions are hard. Uh, being addicted maybe even to a person or an element of a person uh, or, or cutting out someone or something is hard. Let's see. We have oh, it fell. We have caring. Yeah, you do care. There's an element of caring, still caring for this person, still caring for yourself. Magic. You can make anything happen. Aquarius. Oh, I said Aquarius, so it could be done with Aquarius. With um, you can make anything happen. Sagittarius. Um, your sign governs. Mad magic. Your your suit is all about magic and growth. So. You may it may take a bit of magic and mystique to stay on the the course, or magic to to expel uh, some negative energy. Smart, okay. There might be something or someone who who is um, experienced and real. It could be this Queen of Swords. Um, smart. It could be you making smart. And fair and better decisions, better things are getting better. So, Sag, you may be cutting someone, something out of your life, someone who you were addicted to, something you were addicted to. You understand that you need to join a group of people or a set that will help you move forward. You may need to even get better advice from someone who is more experienced because this is the end of an era okay so i hope that this reading resonated for you with you if it did go over to the website book your own reading there take advantage of the readings that are on sale i believe that the 30 minute reading is on sale um and also the 72 hour energy reading is on sale so that's a reading where you book the reading i pull cards for you for love and romance career and finance uh, for the next 72 hours. What's the energy around you for the next 70, 72 hours? Um, you do not get to ask questions with that reading. I pull cards. I explain it. I send the reading to you. So be mindful of that. But I think that's the most uh, inexpensive reading. So take advantage of that if you want to. All right. Sag, know that I'm praying for you. Pray for me as well. Take care. Bye.